All right, so let's take a look at this to do app. All the create, read, update, and delete functionality is added to it. When I'm adding a task, I can specify when do I want to complete this task. All right, let's say I want to do some cleaning. Some cleaning. And I want that to be done by tomorrow. And I'll click submit. Okay, so do some cleaning is the second most urgent task to do because it's gonna be due in 12 hours. 13 minutes okay so the ones with a closer due date will be ranked on top so now let's say if i'm done with editing a youtube video and i want to mark it as complete i'm gonna go to update and if i click back it will take me to the list so i'm gonna click on complete right here this checkbox and click on update it is scratched off and it is right below the list okay so now i want to update a task so let's change it to LAN Django instead and click update. All right, so you can see LAN Django is updated. So that is listing out, that is what we are seeing right now, creating it and also updating it. So now let's see how the delete works. If I click on one of the tasks, I want to remove do some cleaning from the task. I'm gonna click delete and now it's gonna give me some warning. Deleting do some cleaning is permanent. Do you want to proceed? If I click no, it will take me back to the list. So I'm gonna click delete again and this time click yes delete so you can see it has removed it from the database all right so this is the to-do app that we have if you're interested in seeing how this app is built and you're not a subscriber please subscribe to our channel thanks and see you in the next one